You're watching Keystone Science. And in today's episode, we're going to be making a cool wood desk using Lichtenberg figures and high voltage. So we've actually made Lichtenberg figures before in these small planks of wood in a previous episode. And so anyways, that episode will be linked in the description below. Also, we're going to be using one of these microwave oven transformers. Basically, you can get one of these out of a microwave. And so if you need help with figuring out this microwave oven transformer, go ahead and click on the video in the description below, which is actually a video I made a while back showing how to extract and use the microwave oven transformer. As another note, these microwave oven transformers are extremely dangerous. And so with that said, wear electrically insulated gloves such as these, as well as never be near the wires. So basically, hook it up and then use a switch to turn it on while you're standing back far enough. So here I've mixed some baking soda into water to use as an electrolyte. And now I'm going to take this baking soda mixed water and I'm going to paint it all over the top of this desk. And that should be good. Try to get a nice and even coat over the whole thing. Now I'm going to take the high voltage ends of the microwave oven transformer and I'm going to connect it up onto the desk. As the microwave oven transformer burns through the wood, the arc is going to be pretty bright. And so to protect your eyes from the ultraviolet light, wear sunglasses or welding goggles like these. Okay, so now let's go ahead and flip it on and see what happens. Okay, so I think for the pattern on the desk, that's all I'm going to do. Anyways, now I'm going to go ahead and sand out all the charcoal so we get left with the finer details of the fractal. Okay, so now it's all sanded up. As you can see, this method creates amazing fractal patterns. The wood is still wet right now, but when it dries out, I'm going to put this clear gloss over it. So now you know how to use high voltage to create Lichtenberg fractals. Thank you all so much for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, I would appreciate it if you'd leave a thumbs up. And if you'd like to see our weekly science videos, go ahead and hit the subscribe button so they will show up in your newsfeed. Remember guys, if you do this at home, microwave oven transformers will kill you if you touch them, so be very careful. So with that in mind, be safe, and have a wonderful day. You're watching Keystone Science, and in today's episode we're going to show you how a battery works and how you can make your very own.